Hey, what's up guys? I've just arrived here at Las Vegas at the convention center. This place is boiling, so I need to get indoors to show you this incredible arena of the World Vet Championships. I'm gonna get one over here. It is absolutely incredible. Thanks so much for Jula having me here. I can't wait to cover this event this week. I hope you all enjoy it. Let's check it out. This building is insane. It's 1.9 million square feet, I believe. It's the convention center in Las Vegas. Let's go and see what it's all about. Jula are the sponsors for this event. The main sponsors, all the tables, barriers. So right away, we have all the booths that all the players walk through. And here's the booths, incredible. Place for players to check out rubbers, blades, bats. So this is where players get their accreditations. So there's just under 4,000 players here from 97 different countries. Xeon Paddle Palace. Jiwoo, Stiga, Butterfly. It's day, it's day Thursday, it's day four here at the World Veteran Championship. This is amazing. It's the main draw. So all the players now, it's knockout stages. So it's big stuff. Whoa. How's it feel? Yeah, it feels good to win a game. Well done. Yeah. Well done. That's In the it. knockout. That's better yeah. than two years ago. Yes. Yeah. So that's good. Really pleased. Played well. Mixed it well. Good. Thanks, good. coach. Yeah. Yeah. Coach Dan, yeah. I can't rock yeah. up at the end when you finished. <laughs> <laughs> How was the experience taking on Roscoe, obviously a uh, legend of the game? He's, uh, he's very good, he's uh, very consistent and he goes to the body almost every time. Yeah. Yeah, he knows, he knows how to pick on your weaknesses. But on the other hand, there's no pressure for us, right? That's true. So you can just go down just and go just for it. fight yeah, for everything for sure. you can. Good point. But good you point. still know that that's Rossi, no matter how hard. Doesn't matter what you want. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Amazing, good to meet you guys. My coaching this morning paid off. <laughs> You're playing well. That's why, that's why it was so easy. No, okay, it was quite easy. The yeah. other guy was a bit nervous. I think that's how it's going here, that they are you quite nervous. That. You can see that. So I think from, let's say from the last 16 on, there you have really tough matches yeah. where you also have to compete. Yeah. Done the business. My business. Done it. Signing and make pictures. I wanted to win because I've been out of table tennis in 90 years. Wow! Yes, I played a lot when I was a young player. And then I came back. I think the last half year I've been practicing a lot. As a legend, Alan Benson, sipping some water, getting ready for the next set. We're 
along the monorail with Matt Hamilton. We are going to... Where are we going, Matt? The Brooklyn Bowl. World Veterans Tour. For once, I'm not in table tennis daily kit. Matt's not in his jeweler table tennis kit either. No, We're rocking it. Here's Flamingos, the first hotel on the Vegas Strip. This is, the strip. This is like the original. Old Vegas. Old Vegas is like separate to here. So there's like the old town. Uh -huh. And but then when they built the strip, the Flamingo was the first hotel that right. they built here. Here it is, the World Veterans Table Tennis Tour. Yeah, check this out, a swanky VIP. I haven't got mine yet. Buses are coming in first. Right, it's got some good news. So I got my VIP pass. Here it is. And guess who else has got one now? Matt's got it. Certified important. You are so important, Matt. Free food and free alcohol. Oh, it's a messy night, this one. <laughs> Table tennis lifelong, eh? Oh, yeah. Got at least 50 years left in it. Do you think we'll be in the Vets Championships one day, Matt? Yeah, I'm gonna beat you. Me and Why you in the final. Same, yeah. Over 40. Yeah. How old are you? Uh, 28. I'm 28 as well. There we go. 12 years time. Check in 12 years. 12 years time, guys. Watch this vlog back in 12 years time. Lovely day. Good luck in your matches and the rest of the week. Thank you guys. <laughs> 10 seconds to go. There's Caesar's Palace. Flamingos. Matt's still here. Parents are here having a lovely time. <laughs> yo! Hey! Yo, yo, yo. What are you guys doing? Ping pong. Ping pong? The world. Ping pong you mean table here. tennis? Yeah, oh, no. I love that. Yeah. Table tennis. Are you are you playing table tennis? Yeah. Are you like the general public? So I was like, oh, I'll use ping He's pong. With you. He only I started plays table tennis in my college. He only plays beer pong. Oh. That's all he plays. <laughs> it's a late night here in Vegas. We've just watched the fountains for the first time. Matt Harrington showing us around. Having a great time. This. We've got the ping pong championships tomorrow. Are you looking forward to tomorrow? Oh yes, we're going to whip some butt. Yeah, you reckon? After I've destroyed Waskov. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be interesting. Hey guys, just at the monorail. About to catch it to head to Jorg Roskov and Chamak Singh's hotel. Going to follow them into the arena, talk to them about what they had for breakfast and all good things about the upcoming day. What do you normally have for breakfast then on a, on a day when you prepare for a tournament? Cereals and fruits. That's yeah. it. I drink no coffee, so. Okay, no so coffee, yeah? No coffee. One minute. This could be a long journey to the stadium. Oh, the jeweler shades are on. Oh no. Uh, no, the, no, I forgot it. <laughs> oh, what is, this is a bad advertisement. <laughs> this is from Olympics. Yeah. Very nice, very nice. What has um, been your favorite moment here in Las Vegas so far? Favorite moment? I think usually the players, they would say, uh, that they won in gambling, but I was not gambling at all, so uh, uh, no. I see obviously the ITTF are making the World Veteran Tour. Yeah. What's your thoughts on this and how? how's I, your, yeah. I heard about it, but I don't know exactly how they want to do it. Uh -huh. So uh, I think it's a huge market because uh, yeah, a lot of veterans, a lot of old players, former players, uh, yeah, they are well known all over the world, yeah. and. Uh -huh. uh, I said it years before that uh, this would this is a big chance for for the IDTF or someone who wants to organize it, like Legends Tour or Veterans Tour or something. I think there was a quite there is a quite big big market for this, yeah, because the people around in the world they want to see what what is Waldner doing or Legal Young is doing and how they are playing and they remember what they did in the past and how many titles they won and they enjoy to watch them so I think this is quite it's, interest. Yeah, it was such an incredible generation of players. Yeah.
How'd you cook in the final? It's like 20 years before, 1989. <laughs> <laughs> hey Alan, having a good time here? This is a great time, just all the international competition and just camaraderie has been really spectacular. It's been a blast. There's such a great wide range of players, ages, abilities. It just shows the table that this is so lifelong. And Absolutely. My favorite match so far has actually been, I think it was the over 85 doubles match I just watched. It was just, they were having such a good time and it was still competitive and they can still move. How was your experience taking on yoga person Eric Lind in the half final? It was wonderful. Uh, 24 years ago we played in the same team, Jürgen and me. Oh, wow. Only for a short time, he played in Berlin. Ah. So it, it was very wonderful to see him again. It's wonderful. So many people I, I knew a long time ago, 30 years never, not seen, or 20 years, and good players, and wonderful. Feels like it was in Dortmund. <laughs> Good memories. Well Good done. memories. Thank you. Congratulations. The over 40s doubles final women. What a serve. There we go, the over 40s ladies doubles champions. Matt's working on what hours of sleep? <laughs> the over 45 world veteran championship doubles final. That was a tongue twister. But the Chinese team, incredible. <laughs> ITTF Vice President Petra Soling. Sir. There they go! World over 40 doubles champions. Look at that. Congratulations, to world Thanks, champions. Sir. Thank you so much. How does it feel? It's amazing. It's a little bit hard to, to take in, to be honest. For me, it's so surprising. He was asking the Swedish uh, journalist what's the best, and actually, we, we didn't have the interview at the same time, and we said the same to win Petra and to win Kia because we met each other. So many years ago, I was 14, Petra 10, and we met through table tennis. And now, actually, we had a break for a long many years, and we are now back. Thank you. World class. Always came here to win. It's always going to win. <laughs> no, it's not always, but it was good. Yeah. Four world champions to warm up. Eh? That's it. Watch your how she bows to her teammate after the set. Incredible sportsmanship. I've actually never ever seen that before. They're still in battle. She's 2 1 down and she bows to her teammate to show respect. Pretty incredible. Here we go. And it's on the forehand. There it is. 11-9 to Rossi, 2-0 up, close game. Wow! There we have it, Rostov is through to the quarter-finals. 3-0. Best coach ever. It's all kicking off over here, chanting, singing. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
World Vet Championships, it's incredible. The semi finals are about to start. Really good crowd already, looking good, lots of people. In fact, it's absolutely packed out. I need to sit somewhere over there, but I'm going to struggle, it looks. And there's Jorgen Persson in his semi finals. 10 9 to the Chinese Taipei player. Well, under a great deal of pressure here. Good serve. Okay, Rossi loses his first set of the championships. It'll be interesting to see how he recovers in the next set. Good serve. Rossi catches people on that serve a lot. A lot of people push that one. It's heavy topspin side spin, but it looks backspin. Oh. There we have it. Jorgen through to the final, wins 12-10. And East Taipei guys flying. Storms his way into the fifth set. We've got a fifth set encounter now. Rossi in a lot of trouble. Oh, good start from Rossi. 2 0. Oh. Here we go. Oh. What a point. Good touch. Rossi's really made it difficult for the opponent to attack in this set. He's completely cancelled him out. Good touch again there. It's a good play. Nine, two to Rossi in the fifth set. Yeah, he's still going to keep fighting. Whoa. And Chen is through to the final with that win over Matt Shelberg. And so has Rossi. Great game there. You had, yeah, me, close. you had me worried. Yeah, it was a close match. <laughs> yeah, okay. I didn't play for years against Ben Holder, so it was this was the traditional old style how he was playing. So ah, it was funny to play against him because you know what was coming, but he hit quite good shots with his backhand. Well done, Chen, you're through. With his backhand and with forehand. But in the end, the concentration was there from the beginning, the fifth, and this is important. Here's the women's final. Over 45s, Christina Simens versus Yang Haiyan. Need to get Chen and Roscoff as they walk in. Can't miss this. This place is absolutely rocking for this final. Chen Waxing versus Jorg Roscoff. So these players are getting ready for the next lot of matches. Warming up. 
at the size of this place, it's packed. Look at this, everyone's got their phone out, trying to get that perfect photo. Take out that computer. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> How's he getting that on? Oh. <laughs> Obstruction. <laughs> oh, he looks tired. <laughs> the organ person's in the fifth set. It's a big one. This player is Clan Pa's nephew, an incredible player. Oh, great shot. Good serve there. There is Jürgen Persson. He's the world vet champion. Yeah, it was top belly, yeah. I was up to zero and I thought, okay, it's, it looks pretty easy, yeah. But against Andras Popinka, you can never relax. He played very quick. Mm -hmm. And then when he came back, yeah, and then of course in the fifth game, I was down also, so. So it was a nice victory then. It was a very nice game. You have a great fan base. Do you have anything to say to your fans? The fans, it's always nice. I mean, to come and get the support. I mean, yeah. and also really that they have the knowledge. I mean, what you did previously. And it's nice to come here to give back a little. It's really nice. I'm enjoying. So now I can go to my pool, take a nice cocktail and enjoy the rest of this Vegas tour. Here's the over 80s World Championship final. Both players from the USA. Richard Hicks. Richard Hicks and Chen Kong. Oof. Touched, what a point. 7 6 to Richard Hicks. This is going to the wire, I tell you. Incredible stuff. Richard Hicks got pips on the back end. He's twiddling as well. Red side seat, twiddled there to the black. He might twiddle again in a second. He's got all sorts of variation with his game. His opponent is staying close to the table, taking it early. Oh, nice class. Four world championship points for Richard Hicks in the over 80s competition. What a point. There it is. Richard Hicks is the world over 80 champion. Look at that, incredible. So much respect for one another. Amazing to see. Guys, here's the over 90s World Championship final. It's in the fifth and final game. Oh, what a forehand. This is absolutely world class stuff. 10 8. 
World Championship point for the Chinaman and the Czech Republic's called a timeout. If I was playing at this age, I'd be very happy. Here he goes, 10-8 down in the fifth. Oh. Oh! There it is. Incredible battle. Rossi, what happened? Uh, he's too strong. He's, he's three years younger. That, that's, that's why he wants so easy. <laughs> That's uh, some good fun rallies. Yeah, it was good. So, did you enjoy the experience as a whole? Yeah, it was a nice experience. New experience. Uh, because it's totally different from the what we knew before. But, uh, yeah, it's a lot to do, a lot of work. We did a lot for Yola here. We did a lot of pictures, selfies, autographs. Yes. But this is more hard work than to play. <laughs> so, if we have extended the court, it was much easier because then you knew there was just the player and the umpire, that's all. Yeah. You didn't have people like me chasing you. <laughs> you had to chase. Wow, there we have it guys, that was the World Veteran Championships. What an incredible event, I've had a great time here with Jula. The whole building now is getting packed down. It was incredible, I really had a great time. I really hope you enjoyed all the videos and all the great interviews from all the fantastic players. You know, it just goes to show how much this sport is all about friendship, having a great time, meeting new people. Also, this sport is, is so lifelong. You know, players here are over 90 playing in the World Championships. I really hope I can do that one day. It really was inspiring, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and stay tuned for many more. Thanks for watching.